Hi, I'm Brian Sprange. I'm from the Winnipeg Office of Javelin Technologies. I work as a technical solutions expert, mostly on the SOLIDWORKS side of things, and I've been asked to help with this project. In the previous video in this series, my colleague Deandra scanned the main landing gear area of the aircraft with an Artec EVA 3D scanner. Now that she's processed that through Artec Studio, to get a digital copy of the underside of the plane, I'll use a combination of SOLIDWORKS and Geomagic to design the landing gear door panels. So my previous aerospace experience, I actually worked at a couple of different aerospace companies in the past, and one of which I was actually working on landing gear tooling. So it was kind of interesting that I was asked to help with this project because I have specific experience in aerospace and also with designing gear doors. I have experience using advanced surfacing techniques and reverse engineering parts. So I'm going to take the scan data along with the original drawings for the plane to create a SOLIDWORKS model of the landing gear door. Once I have a model, I can pass it to our additive manufacturing team for them to 3D print the final flight ready part. With Geomagic for SOLIDWORKS plugin, I can extract simple features such as the flat walls of the landing gear housing to ensure that I have an accurate fit for my final part. More importantly, I'll extract the complex surface which represents the underside of the wing. Combining and trimming all the extracted surfaces together gives me a surface to use for the exterior of the gear doors. However, this is when I notice that the door needs to have extra clearance in a few places where the landing gear is retracted. With a small amount of surface modeling, the space for the wheel is added to the surface pulled from scanning and a relief hole is created for the pivot mechanism. Geomagic is a great option for this project because it lets us use the existing plane geometry that's there, especially being a hand-built plane means that it could have slight variations and Geomagic is able to take that geometry and we can use it to help with the design in SOLIDWORKS and make sure that it's actually the right fit and it's going to be the right surfaces once we've printed the part. Now that the exterior surface of the gear door is defined, I need to generate the internal surfaces which will make the panel strong when 3D printed. My additive manufacturing colleague will handle the conversion to a lattice structure in the thickened areas. This will increase the panel strength while minimizing weight. Traditionally, this process requires many more hours of work and a substantial amount more guesswork to generate the required outer surface. The Geomagic process for this part took about a half hour in total. By leveraging the robust capabilities of Geomagic for SOLIDWORKS, I can reduce the design time. All of the tools are laid out in the same way as you would expect with SOLIDWORKS, so the learning curve honestly was about 10 minutes for me. It's just the same looking icons, the same tools, and the other huge advantage is it's within the same spot. So with this project, actually a couple of times, I pulled out the surfaces that I thought I would need, started doing some work and realized I needed some more. So it's just simply navigating over to a different tab, pulling out the additional surfaces you need, they end up in the feature tree, and then you can go back to surface designing. So it's a very seamless transition, you can go back and forth. You don't have to keep exporting or importing different things. More importantly, I know that once these panels are manufactured, they will line up exactly with the aircraft, reducing the chance of costly delays and rework. It's really easy to use and it's quick is the big thing. Contact us today to schedule a Geomagic demonstration with one of our SOLIDWORKS experts. We have offices across Canada with dedicated staff that are happy to answer your questions.